How can you make money with such a stupid idea? And how can you not make money with such a brilliant idea? Ah, at first we didn't know what to do with all the money. We tried burying it, <laughs> shredding it, <gasps> and burning it. <laughs> but in the end, we decided to just give it all away. Come again, sir. I'm getting back in line. Hey guys, welcome back to the Dustin Dean channel. And today, I'm going to build inner hive covers. Um, this is an inner hive cover. These are about $20, $25 a piece. Um, this is uh, uh, stuff you put in like a utensil drawer. See that? And uh, this is about $5. So $15, $20 cheaper. And um, we're going to figure out how to, uh, I think we can put this on an inner, inner cover. And so we're going to quickly build one. And we're going to try it out, see how it works. Is that square up with that? That? Yeah, that's not good to do. Okay, so why I chose uh, this as an inner cover is um, it feels durable to me. It, um, has holes that can breathe. I'm thinking of wintering them up. This is kind of a, it, it's a I, what gave me this idea was an, an afghan. Um, it's, a, a, it's what a lot of um, ladies like to use to warm up. It's got little holes in it. You usually see it at your grandma's house. Uh, and it, Shakar makes them. What are they called? Afghans. Afghan? An afghan. And so this is kind of like a little afghan for the uh, for the bees to snuggle up and, and winter on. So we'll go throw that on a hive, and and uh, um, I'll make more later. So I'd like to hear you guys' thoughts on that, you bee people out there. Is this going to make a good afghan for the uh, for the bees versus this? And um, which I I don't know. Oh, they're packed full. I'll smoke them down under. Perfect. Okay, so I did my little notch here. So if I put a, a bottle on there, I could I could set some, like right here, and they can come right through these cracks, get to the bottle, and um, <laughs> they're looking up at me. It's funny. I'm teasing the bees. Don't tease the bees. Stop teasing the bees. So that'll be where I'd feed them, where I can keep that closed, and uh, robbers can't get in there. So, okay. One thing I love about this hobby is that uh, it could be as cheap as you want it to be. Um, basically, all the bees need, needs is a box to live in. But uh, if you can't afford a suit and you don't mind getting stung, well, hold off on buying a suit. This is gonna stung a lot if you. Uh, um, don't have a hive tool, pocket knife works just fine, as you can see. And um, so you just kind of pay as you go. I don't know any other hobbies that you can really do that, pay as you go. Like uh, racing cars, you got to buy the whole car and all that up front. But this is, you can start off cheap and work your way up. to make just maybe one more I think and I'm liking this idea I'm thinking this is better this came to me at like at three o'clock in the morning I just can't cut a straight line if cops made me do this to pass a DUI test I'd fail I'll get a DUI, even though I haven't been drinking. I just can't cut, cut straight. Don't judge me. We're still in the one roll. 
bet you I can make bet you I can make three more of these. So so far I've made two. Shout out Mama Cat. Mama Cat's pregnant again. Mama Cat's pregnant again, but this will be our last litter and we're getting her fixed. She's gonna be retired from from having babies. Isn't that right, Mama Cat? Ah, right, two more. We got two more, so we got four inner covers, five bucks, versus a $25 inner cover. And this does pretty much the same thing. Might even be better. Time will tell. New hive, it's no bees in here yet, but uh, maybe that nuke, when they get strong enough, will probably go into this one. Make our little area for the feeder by doing our, our little uh, pyramid. Something maybe like that, maybe. Maybe a little bigger. Okay, then then when you get your uh, mason jar bottle, you just sit on top of there and you can feed your bees. So there's my inner cover, my new inner cover. So that was a five dollar roll. So far we've done two covers, saving ourselves a ton of money. You know, no wonder commercial beekeepers don't like me, because <laughs> they're the ones that usually sell expensive twenty dollar inner covers. So here I am on YouTube, teaching people how to save money on beekeeping. I encourage people to beekeep because you can make good meat out of money. <laughs> <laughs> and who knows? I might come over as a guest. <laughs> the more beekeepers, the better. <laughs> All right, you gotta come around and look at this, Shakar. This is this is pretty funny. They're, they're dragging out the elastic band out of their hive. <laughs> we're working on that green one right there. You can see it shaking. Yeah. But they drug that out. So this this rubber band is what I use for uh, um, a cutout. And you can see they're dragging that out. They're dragging that right out the front door. You can see where they've been biting on it and when they took that off, they says, we don't want that. We don't want that in there. And they got this other one here helping them out. <laughs> one just chased me out. Guard bee. Really gentle bees. Look at that. I stuck my finger in the, in the hole. And there are bees in here. You don't believe me. I just stuck my finger in that hole like that. Nothing. Nighttime. Evening, nothing. Look at the bees. See that? Really gentle bees. See, touching them all, yeah, rubbing them. This is why I'm doing a split. These guys are. It's a, a breeding program we have here at the at the farm. We uh, try to keep nice stock around. So, oh, what was I talking about? They're making a queen. So that's an, this is another little um, kind of an experiment I'm doing is can I start a nuke here and um, have it still be alive come spring. So this is uh, most people say no it can't be done because you have to you start your nukes in the spring and it takes all summer long to get them strong enough to survive a winter. So this is an experiment. I'm trying one in the fall and uh, We'll see if this will survive all winter. I think it will. I think it'll work. Only one way to find out. And uh, if there's one thing I've learned in life is um, try for yourself. Just because everybody says you can't be done doesn't mean it can't be done. So, guys, I'm Dustin Dean, and thank you for watching.